Hi, I'm going to show you how to make um, spaghetti carbonara. It's a really, really straightforward recipe. Okay, so the first thing you're going to do is you're going to get your spaghetti cooked um, and in a pan of boiling water with a little bit of salt in it, get your spaghetti in there and then it takes eight to ten minutes to make perfect spaghetti. So we're going to cook our spaghetti first and we're going to get ready to make our sauce. Okay, so what we're going to use, um, now you can use Philadelphia cheese if you want, but this was Asda own, which was think a quarter of the price and we're going to use three quarters of a tub of this creamy delightful cheese so we're going to put that in our mixing bowl and then to that what we're going to do is we're then going to add two egg yolks okay now if you've never separated an egg from the egg white before this could be your chance um, so what we're going to do we're going to crack your egg and move the pepper away crack your egg and we're going to pour the white bit of the egg and you basically scoop it from side to side in the shell so all we want is the yolk and we put the yolk in there and the rest of it you can either keep to make meringues um, or we can get rid of it so I'm going to break this one open okay what we, oh what we don't want it to do if it falls into the pot we need to do scoop it out of your shell and we're just going to scoop it from side to side okay, and then we're going to put that one in there okay so we want two egg yolks in there then what we're going to do is we're going to beat that together with a fork. So we want it all mixed up with a fork. Okay. So here we go. So we want the egg and the cheese to be beaten up together in a fork. Okay, and what you've got to do is really give that a good... So it makes a real sloppy mush. Okay. So the egg is all taken in with the cheese. So you don't want any bits of egg. So we mix it all in and it kind of changes colour a little bit, it goes kind of creamy colour. Okay, now you're going to add some black pepper to that. So you're going to add some black pepper. You can add a little bit of salt as well. Um, I'm just going to add some black pepper. Now you're not going to it's not going to be really peppery. So if your kids or you don't like pepper, it's not really peppery, just add a little bit of pepper, it just gives it a little bit of flavour, just give it a bit more of a mix. And that's what we want. And we're not going to cook it yet because we're going to put it in with our pasta. So what we need to do next is we're going to drain our pasta and this pan is still hot we drain our pasta give it a little scoop put our pasta back in and then what we're going to do is we're going to add some of this sauce onto our pasta i'm not going to add it all because i haven't made masses of pasta so we put our sauce onto our pasta um, i need a wooden spoon so we add our, get our spoon here we're going to mix it round and what's going to happen is the heat from the pan on your pasta is actually going to cook that sauce okay so it's going to cook that, that egg really really quickly so we just spin it around oh, and you can actually you can i can feel the heat coming off of that sauce okay so there's our carbonara sauce really really simple now what is quite good to do if you've got some is get some parsley parsley is quite quite cheap, this is 35p, um, and all you're going to do is you're going to give it a little haircut, I'm just going to give the parsley a little haircut into the food, just a little bit, you don't need very much, give it a little chop, there you go, I'm going to stir that in as well, and then put it onto a bowl, pull the sauce over the top, and that is delicious, healthy, spaghetti carbonara. And you haven't had to buy a sauce from the supermarket. You've made it yourself. It's really, really yummy. I'm going to put a whirl a bit round on a fork. That is yummy. And you can put a bit more pepper on the top if you want. But simple, easy food, really delicious. Two eggs, two egg yolks cream cheese, mix it together, whisk it all up, stick a bit of pepper, add it to your spaghetti. That is perfect sauce. Mm. A really, really easy recipe for you to do. Try it at home, get cooking, make your flat cap to go with it. Delicious food. Keep sending in the photos. Brilliant. Have a good cook.